him at home and we got to go up to Bowling Green here I gotta get some puppy pads for my truck and mom's got it with the puppy I'll show you guys too the puppy is loving it uh, he's got all <laughs> he's got all them doggies to play with and he's just having a ball I think it's better for him to be with mom than it was in my truck because he just wanted to play and he didn't have the real estate inside the truck but <laughs> He was a devil. I mean, he was a we're gonna miss him though I told mom if if anything ever happened and she had to get rid of him. I want him I really I, I fell in love with that little guy I really did and I think he came to fell in love with me, but it only took him five minutes To kind of get with mom and he got really with you there mom put him in the yard and uh, His name is Festus right mom was calling him he's coming. Festus Harrison. Yeah Gunsmoke. She named him from the TV show Gunsmoke. If you remember the whisker guy, you know, that always had the argument with the doc. She named him Festus. Festus Gunsmoke? Or Gunsmoke Festus. I didn't want to carry my last name. Gunsmoke Festus. Harrison. So that's what it's going to say on the papers. It's Gunsmoke Festus Harrison. That's a what mouthful. What isn't it? Names. <laughs> But we are on our way to Bowling Green, and we're going to turn right up here, go to Walmart, and uh, I'll show you guys as much as I can. I'm at home, but I'll show you as much as I can. So I stick get around. Dog food. And mom's got to get dog food. I Puppy food. used the last. She only gave me like a, a sandwich bag or a twist or what you call uh, one of them Ziploc bags full. I used the last bit with him, but well, not totally. There's still a little bit in that bowl. Uh, Cause he didn't eat that much, really. He just ate a little bit and he got full. He didn't eat that much dry, did he? Huh? The dry stuff. Yeah, he was nibbling on it, but he. Oh, I was going to show you that can, that soft food can, because he really likes that stuff, and it doesn't hurt his bowels or anything. So, but he really went to town on that. But anyway, we'll be right back, guys. We're in Bowling Green. Get Pooh Bear some food. I like to get the salad food. He, that's really what he likes. He doesn't like the gravy train. You can forget that. He's not a gravy liker. Yeah. And I do get puppy pads. Well, they did block up the aisles any which way. They're worse than row construction. Puppy pads, yeah? Um, if you go down this aisle right here, uh -huh. it'll be all the way down and on your right hand side. Cool. Thank you, ma'am. I do get puppy pads that protect the truck just in case they have to go and I can't stop. See, won't leak, won't spread, and oh, it should be down here. Um, this, this is puppy pad, ain't it? Yeah. It's just our, I mean, you can take that one. It's easier for you to get to. Yeah, well, we got her. All right. It's like a hundred puppy pads, right? Yep. That's perfect. Thank you, man. Appreciate yep. you. You're welcome. All right. Oh. Hmm. Mm-hmm. inside shopping so I got me a pizza and I got what I needed got me a pop shoulder pop let her do her thing we'll just stand out here the van's over there so I can't miss her
this morning I said I'm gonna put up a survey would you guys like me to put up a video we got some stuff at the house of course I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be revealing part of it anyway part of it I'm gonna wait on purpose because there's one special individual that I really want to open that up with in front of um, and we'll have a video on that so I still ain't gonna give away what I got except for part of what I got if that makes any sense because I want him to kind of help me with it as far as and it's going to take time right in other words he'll have to take a break I'll have to take a break and it's going to have to be more than just a few hours so but anyway I'm going to have me another slice of pizza and we'll be right back $5 pizza, awesome, okay. I love them, man. <laughs> I do too. I would have ate it in there, but I was afraid that, you know, think I stole it. <laughs> <laughs> She's ready for NASCAR, guys. <laughs> I like riding in them things, man. I don't. Heck yeah, that, that's for people that are lazy like myself, you know. I said people that are lazy like myself. The only problem about old people and them things, they block up everything. You're just forgetting the million dollars. Don't forget to pick that up before we leave. I got the getaway. Ah. Well, anyway, we're going to come out here. We'll just wait for her. I put my stuff in the van, so she's in there just doing her thing. I'm going to get me a Timmy's. I'm going to get me a Timmy's. I'm excited. There's one in Bowling Green. You guys remember? I'm going to get me a Tim Hortons, and then we're going to head home. Oh, yeah. dead to the world you have a Timmy's with a shot of espresso brings you to life there it is guys we're at Timmy's mama took me to Timmy's because you begged. <laughs> I did beg I didn't get on my knees because I was kind of sitting down kind of close to it that would have been next I love Tim Hortons oh man oh now you know what guys having this coffee made this a perfect day we'll be right back and just like that we are sitting at the house come on guys no no come on i'm on the porch having me a tim horton coffee i'm here to tell you guys life couldn't be any better this is what you call relaxation plus i got some stuff to show you in the house here real shortly i'm gonna run inside here in a minute but right now we're just relaxing we back out here? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. dog poor one, two, three, four, five, six, six dogs and counting Pooh Bear and one cat. Of course, three of the doggies are mine, so that means mom's got three dogs herself. just having fun <coughs> all right I got two boxes actually I got three I got three things that came in the mill and uh, 
One is for my phone. One is another thing, but I'm going to wait on that. There's a reason behind that. But I got one in my hand here. I'm not going to wait. We got a package here. So we're going to do a little reveal. Oops. I know what it is and I'm excited. Looky here. I guarantee I'm the only one that's got one unless he ordered one. Looky there. Okay, see that? I have me a Trucker Rudy coffee cup. Well, we're cooking. Oh, I just about stepped on a doggy. <sighs> We're cooking us a hamburger. It ain't steak, but I wanted a hamburger. Well, guys, we are actually done for today. I'm still at my mom's. I'm still here. But uh, we're done. It was a nice day. It was a very, well, we went to town and we had some burgers on the grill got my trucker Rudy cup and uh, I got another box but I'm waiting on that one and I got my reasoning so but when the time comes and the time is right I will show you guys what's in that box only a few selected people know and hopefully I can keep it that way until I'm ready to reveal it um, I got to be a little good with it before I start talking about it because well if I go on with this you'll you'll figure out what it is but anyway we are done for today and uh, hey um, we don't deliver our next load until 6 a.m. on Wednesday so but we're not going to stay here overnight tomorrow night we will be leaving tomorrow but not early uh, I'm going to have my coffee in the morning and stuff and about 10, 11 o'clock, give or take, we'll be leaving. So, But anyway, I want to thank you guys for chiming and following us. And uh, hey, you know, it's a crazy world to live in. Or it's a crazy world that we do live in. And uh, just remember, um, uh, being good and being respectful starts with you first. And it's like a domino effect from that point. Hopefully somebody else catches it and understands what you're doing and, and, and maybe the next person, you know. But what's probably more important than anything is, um, you know, treat others like you want to be treated. Really, that's the way it goes. Even if somebody treats you not so respectful, um, it takes two um, to make an argument. It takes two to make a fight. But if you're a bigger person than, than that person, even if that person disrespects you, respect them. Because what's going to end up happening is if this person is angry with you, mad at you, or doesn't like you, or does, but if you're smiling and you're respecting this person, this other person may think you know what maybe he's not a bad guy after all you know make a good impression right but anyway enough of that we'll see you guys later see i got a message and you guys be good and we'll talk to you tomorrow remember 4 a.m there's another video tomorrow we'll talk to you guys later later <laughs>